Good day, everyone! Have you ever wondered why everything that we throw up eventually goes back to the ground? Yes, you are correct. That is because of gravity. In Newtonian physics, the idea of gravity is that it is a force. Yet, according to Albert Einstein, it is not a force. Hmm, how is this possible? Alright, today, for us to understand the idea of Albert Einstein about gravity, we will explore the world of one of his famous theories, the General Theory of Relativity. Let's go, mga kasiyansya! In 1907, Albert Einstein imagined a person falling from a building stack. He later considered it the happiest thought of his life because he was imagining that as the person was falling, he became weightless and that by going free fall, there will be no gravitational force. This idea became to Einstein's principle of equivalence, which states that gravity is equivalent to a uniformly accelerated reference frame and serve as the backbone of his general theory of relativity. Einstein did not consider gravity to be a force in this theory, but rather a consequence of space-time warping Earth curve. This concept runs counter to Isaac Newton's law of universal gravitation, which views gravity as a force of attraction between objects based on their masses. Space-time is a four-dimensional continuum composed of the three-dimensional space and one-dimension of time. But let me help you further understand the warping or curving of space-time through this simulation using fabric. A fabric can be used to imitate the warping or curving of space-time. When you roll a ball across the cloth, it moves in a straight path. However, if you insert a heavier ball or object in the middle, the cloth will warp. The ball will no longer move in a straight line if you roll it again. As a result, it will take a bend course around the heavier ball at the center, causing space-time to warp. The application of the general theory of relativity can be observed in the principle of GPS or Global Positioning System. GPS is utilized when you use the locator in your cell phone or trace your route on a car navigation system. Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity opens new door for science. General theory of relativity not only surprised scientists, but it has also fascinated us all. <laughs>